If he is, he barely is. Yeah, he's a nine point, I believe. Oh, that's a nice spot. That second one back is young. Yeah, that one's mature too, I believe. That wide one. The one walking? No, the other one. One walking's a two or three year old. The other is the one he just passed. Mm -hmm. The one he just passed, that's he did. This is the one you said for mature. Yeah, I think so. You can lose one. Dang it, don't you turn back that way. What's he watching? Stay on that buck if he offers you the shot. Take it. There's a bobcat coming in. There's a feeder. Can I shoot? I felt comfortable. Can I shoot him? Wait. Let that other one move. And then do you want me to shoot that cat? Yes. Okay. All right. Take him. He's right in front of the tree. All right. Get on that cat. Cat got up, cat got up, cat got up. He's wide, isn't he? Nice eight point. Nine point. Yeah. He's old, I think. Got a lot of white in his face. He's mature. I'm, he's mature. He's got kind of a Roman nose too. Big bodied for up here. He's thin, but worn down from the rut. Look at that one ear. It's yeah. kind of. Got a funny little thing going on there. He may be close to 20 inches wide. He's a good buck for sure. Yeah. He looked a lot wider than that coming in with that sun in his back, oh, yeah, didn't he? Oh, he did. He's a great buck for sure. Well, congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome. So... We waited on that buck forever to turn. Tell what happened. We were waiting and waiting and waiting, and he just stayed looking right at us, eating. And all of a sudden, about the eight bucks that were here all looked off in this direction. 
when you scan over there's a pretty good sized bobcat coming in it spooked off some of the bigger deer and this guy was looking at it and I went ahead and took the shot dropped him in his tracks and went over and that cat had just sat down and I put one in that cat and it, it fell and went back to look at my deer and Glenn said that that cat got up and took off so we're gonna go look for it here see if we can't find some blood all right we uh we ended up finding the cat we uh we let the buck lay for a little bit and went back to where we saw the cat drop in its tracks um found just a little speck of meat and hair no blood whatsoever and we started doing a grid search back and forth i left my gun here at the buck we're walking and i had my headlamp shining and i looked up about a hundred yards from where we shot it and i saw a pair of eyes looking right back at me and so uh, i told glenn i come back here and got my gun and we walked up to it and it was still very much alive looking right back at us and i uh, ended up hitting one more into it to dispatch it it was a good shot on that first hit um don't really know how he got up from it and ran off blew out his shoulder but uh we ended up hitting him down so that's going to end 2020 with a one bobcat and one very nice buck on the same hunt it's been a great year well i'm glad you got him killed they are hounding the heck out of these deer up here on oh, this yeah. food no, plot he came in those deer were scared and he came in for no other reason than to get one of these deer he was staring them down the entire time he was walking in there were yeah, no yeah. birds no rabbits he was coming after a deer all i can say is he wasn't gun shy enough mm -mm. <laughs> no sir <laughs> all right let's get them loaded up and head out of here alamo precision rifles the best rifles this side of the pecos aprifles.com Hornady. Accurate, deadly, dependable. Pink's Paint and Body. Decatur, Texas. Mallory Orthodontics. MalloryOrtho.com. 2K Pond and Gun. Decatur, Texas. Carrillo and Tibbles, Attorney at Law.